Cleveland Brown quarterback Kevin Hogan potentially may be starting this week for the Browns. We're going to take a look at some of his ill-advised or missed opportunities from last week against Cincinnati. Here we see Hogan in the shotgun, and he clearly has a too-high safety look. He elects to hit the check down when he could have tried to fit a ball top of the screen into that cover two void with a corner pocket fade ball that he elects not to take. Now again, that's a throw that will take guts. It's going to take anticipation from Hogan, so he's not going to be able to step up. It's an anticipatory throw, and Hogan thinks about it, and then he takes the check down. He needs to be more of a gunslinger there and really take that chance. So the very next play, the Browns come back, and Hogan gets a completion against a single high safety look. And he does an excellent job of throwing a skinny pose to Gary Barnage, looking the safety off for just a split second, thrown with anticipation there. Okay, so that's something that he did at Stanford, and he can clearly do that at the pro level. Throw between the numbers with timing and anticipation and enough velocity. That's a good throw. Real good throw for Hogan. Now here's a red zone first and ten. So again, they've got that too high shell. Um, Hogan is going to take the cover two opportunity here finally. So he takes it this time, but the ball gets batted down. Now Hogan's feet are not good here. They are very, very reminiscent of Blake Bortles. Okay, That looks like Blake Bortles to me, honestly. Just a lack of feet energy, and he waits to throw the ball. So number one, he's not gaining depth away from center. Number two... He's taking too long to throw the football. Um, so that's something that, had Hogan been a little bit more anticipatory there as well, that could have been a scoring opportunity. We'll see it from this angle once. The end zone. Um, watch how he doesn't gain any depth, and he's lazy with his feet. He needs to be more decisive. The ball ends up getting batted down because he doesn't gain enough depth away from the defensive line. 